All right, welcome to the channel, friends. So today's video is gonna be covering the Google Nest thermostat third gen, and I'm gonna be going over how to set up your Nest app and also how to lock and unlock your device. Um, you cannot lock or unlock the device without using the app. So that's something you have to use in conjunction with the thermostat in order to activate your pin code uh, to use with a thermostat and then afterwards you can punch it into a thermostat itself and lock and unlock it from there. But since you have to do these together, I'm going to make a video showing these together and go over the steps of how exactly to download the app, uh, which is very simple and how to connect it to your thermostat. So as you can see here, this is um, the app right here. It mimics the thermostat and you have every single thing that's available on the thermostat on the on your smartphone now. It makes it very easy to use. You have a nice big screen to make your adjustments and uh, it makes life a lot easier. So, as you can see here, we have our mode, eco, fan, all these different modes that we have on the thermostat. Here's a timeline for our set points, our schedule. And you have everything available to you that you have on the thermostat. And um, you can have out, it has outdoor temperature because this is connected to Wi Fi now. And you have the inside humidity, which is coming from the thermostat itself. Now, I'm going to go ahead now and start from scratch and show you what this um, process is step by step. Um, and, and completely, it only takes about two, three minutes to do. It really doesn't take that long. So let's go ahead and remove the device because we want to remove. So we hit the settings button here. We're gonna remove thermostat down at the bottom here, okay? So I wanna start from scratch and show you exactly how this is done in real time. So you wanna first download your app, okay? Go to the Google Play Store or Apple Play Store or whatever, download your, your Nest app. And as you can see here, this is the screen you're gonna get when you download it and open up the application. Now, as you can see here, there's two options. There's home and then there's away. That, that's essentially um, how this kind of like breaks it down into two categories, whether you're home or away. Um, we're just gonna click on home right now and we're gonna add product. Uh, this is gonna ask you to use your camera. You don't have to use that. Essentially, you could scan the QR code in the back of the thermostat. I'm not gonna do that. Now, this is the add products list. It's going to show you a whole different list of different Nest products. And there's all, a whole bunch of different things on here. But I'm going to go ahead and click on the Nest thermostat. Okay. And this one here is the third gen, which is the first selection here. There's the, which is the learning thermostat. And then you have other options such as the thermostat E. And then the thermostat E with heat link E. So we're going to click on the first one because that's what we have here. It's going to need to use my location. I'm going, to, I'm going to hit continue. Only this one time. I'm going to say start install here. Um, third gen, which is the one we have here. So the first selection. Uh, it's going to ask you to switch the power off. It's going to go through a bunch of setup things. Um, essentially telling you to shut the power off, hook up the thermostat, and so on. Essentially, it's like an installer setup. So from the very from scratch... Mounting it on the wall, hooking up the wires, and things like that. I'm just going to fast forward through these. Okay, it just wants you to take a photo to have a, a reference. I'm going to skip that. Okay, it's still going through the setup, asking you for high if it's high voltage or not high voltage. It's not high voltage. Do you have two labels on the wires? I'm going to say no because I don't. And then I'm going to go ahead and just click the wires that I have attached to the back of this thermostat. You may have different wires or less wires. But I'm going to go ahead and click those. You know, still asking you a bunch of th different things here. Disconnect and remove your old thermostat, blah, blah, blah. Um, use trim plate, use electrical box. So it's going through the install steps still. And now it's showing you connect the wires to the back of the Google Nest uh, wall plate. Attach the thermostat display. We're almost there. 
switch power back on, continue setup on the thermostat. Okay, so now you want to enter the, the, uh, the product key or whatever, the thermostat key. So it says enter key. And essentially, you want to come over here to the thermostat and go to the settings. So the little gear icon, click on that. Now go all the way to the Nest app, which is to the right. We're going to click on that. We're going to say reset connection. Because I already had this thing connected. So we want to do another reset on just the connection for the, the Nest app. So we have to turn the ring and then hit OK. Now this may take a, a few moments here, but I want to show you guys in real time what it's like uh, to do this from scratch, removing and adding. So it gives you a good idea of what it takes. Some people like to have step-by-step -step instructions, and this is exactly uh, what I'm displaying here today. Okay, so now the thermostat wants to restart. We're gonna we're gonna restart now. It's kind of annoying to go through all these steps, but you know, for the sake of instruction, it's uh it's well worth it. Almost there. <laughs> it's loading up now. Okay, so now we're back in action. So we're going to enter the key. So let's go back to the gear icon. So it's going to ask for QR code or entry key. We want the entry key. Hit select, and then right there on the screen is going to be the entry key. So I'm going to go ahead and type this in. It's a bunch of letters and numbers. Just the way it is right here on the thermostat. And that looks correct. I'm going to hit go. Uh, choose the number that matches your thermostat display. So this is correct right here, this first line. So I'm going to click on that. Now it's going to want to try to connect the phone to the thermostat. Okay, so now it, it picked up my Wi-Fi. I'm gonna go ahead and select my Wi-Fi. I'm gonna go ahead and type in my password really quick. Okay, so you want to type in your password on the phone, okay? And let's see if this thing will connect now. It should have no problems. It says finishing up. It's almost there. Added to your account. So this is all set to go now. Added to your account. Sweet. Okay, so I hit next. And I'm just going to name this the entryway thermostat. It gives you a selection of different, you know, options. So you can choose bedroom, master bedroom, kitchen, garage, whatever you want. All right, so now it's going to, how to use auto schedule. No, we're going to pass on that for right now. Um, choose your eco temperatures. Uh, check out my eco mode video. I go over this completely. This is the same exact thing you're going to see on the thermostat as well. Okay, so the same thing applies. Watch my eco mode video for that. It's going to ask you what are you going to be using it for. We're just going to choose heating for right now. You're all done with the setup. Okay, great. Uh, no thanks. 
All right, so this is what it looks like when you open up the app now when you have a thermostat connected. You have your choice of either being home or away. So you have away options and then you have home options. You would have to adjust those accordingly. So we're going to click on the orange. As you can see there, that's going to be your, your connected thermostat. So this is the, the current temperature in the room. And here it is. It just mimics completely the thermostat. And you have a nice big display. You have all your modes and options. So we can go to heat and cool. And as you can see, it updates the thermostat right away. And if we make an adjustment here, it's going to update on the phone as well. You see that? So this is great because you can use your phone now and not have to worry about uh, getting up and going to the wall or in the other room and or the other side of the house to fix your thermostat. You have it all right here at the touch of your phone. Now, you have every single option available, you know, for start eco fan mode schedule like i said you can, it shows your schedule there um, everything is exactly the same so if you want to program your device please refer back to my programming and scheduling video i have videos for every single topic on this device here the, the third gen google nest uh, i cover all sorts of stuff like the menu options how to factory reset uh, this video as you can as you saw, it's lock and unlock. Well, that's coming up in just a moment. Manual override, as well as the eco mode and things like that. So this here mimics the thermostat, but let's go ahead now and learn about how to lock and unlock this thermostat, okay? Now you have to access it at the very first time you do it through the phone. So when you go here, you go to the settings, that little gear icon, and you scroll. And you can see you have all your options here. And right there is lock. Okay. I'm going to choose one, two, three, four for my lock code. It's going to ask me to do it again. One, two, three, four. And now you can see this is locked. Okay. There's a little lock icon that showed up on the screen here on the thermostat. Now we can go ahead and unlock it from the phone. Now the lock disappeared, as you can see. Now we can make our adjustments on our thermostat without problems, okay? So you first have to initially set it up on your smartphone through the app. There's no other way of doing it. But once you do that, then you can come into here, go into the settings, the little gear icon there, and we can lock the thermostat now from the thermostat itself. So we can scroll all the way over to the right to lock, hit select, and we can now lock this. Okay. And it's, say, it's asking for the pin code we want to use. We're going to type in the same exact pin code. Hit continue. Now it's locked. Now we want to unlock it. So we're going to go ahead and dial in the one, two, three. One, two, three, four. And hit unlock. And there you have it. Now we unlock the device. So as you can see, it wanted to first be done through the phone. But then once you did it through the phone, you can go back and do it through the, the thermostat once it's unlocked. So it's it has its flexibility there, but it will not allow you to do it unless the, uh, the Google Nest app is connected to the thermostat in the very beginning of the whole process. So that there is how to unlock and lock and also how to go through the Google Nest app and um, essentially adjust your thermostat. This is exactly the same you're going to find all the same terminology and language that you see in here on the thermostat in the menus and the same icons and symbols. Okay. All in here is all right in here. And then you hit your little gear icon up here for all the same stuff for your auto schedule, your early on, your eco mode, eco temperature, safety temperature, all these different things, fan schedule, Wi-Fi connection, every single thing you got in here, 
okay? It just makes it easier when it's on your phone and you can easy access it that way. Um, check out my other videos if you want to go in depth when it comes to menu settings. I'm not going to go into that with this video because it's already long enough. Uh, but you get the idea. You get the idea of how to unlock and lock and you went ahead and I showed you step by step uh, the Google Nest app, how it's so easy to install on your phone and also connect your device um, and not many other devices. All right, that's gonna be it for the video, guys. I really hope you enjoyed the video. If you have any questions or comments, please place them right down below. And don't forget to check out my other videos. I wanna thank you guys for watching and I'll see you on the next video.